Hello everybody, it's Rhino and I am here today at Disney's Animal Kingdom. It is shockingly quiet over here because Everest right now is under a refurbishment. So I thought, what a great time. And by I thought, what a great time. It was actually Craig Williams who stopped and said, hey, you know what you should do? A merchandise video, uh, a little shopping experience while the attraction is closed because I bet there'll be less people in there. And I said, great idea, Craig. And so here we are. And that's what we're gonna do today. I completely already forgot the name of this. I'll have to read it when I walk into the store. It's the bizarre, so bizarre. How bizarre, how bizarre. Before we go in to go shopping, I do want to remind everybody that this video and everything that we do here is brought to you by Dreams Unlimited Travel. They are experts at helping you plan the perfect Disney vacation. When you book with them, it costs you nothing extra on your trip and you help support the channel, all the content that we produce. So check them out, dreamsunlimitedtravel.com. We appreciate everybody very much out there. I am now developing a very heavy sweat in a lot of areas that I am uncomfortable with. So let's go inside and do a shopping video in an air conditioned area. Circa Zong Bazaar. That would be what Craig was trying to whisper to me. <laughs> into the bazaar. Into the bazaar. I feel like I was trying to make it into the unknown and it didn't happen. Ooh. Look at all the Yeti stuff. I'm just gonna walk in a little circle for a second and then we'll come back and start looking at things. Just so we can see what it looks like since it's normally filled to the brim with people. Oh, would you, would you look at that? A Yeti spotting. All right. I'm gonna start right here. Spirit jerseys, boom. Look at this though. It's like actually cute and patterned. And this material is a little bit better than they normally are. $75. He is cute though. Oh, look at him. He's relaxing in the sun. Some more Yeti stuff. I conquered the Yeti. Who doesn't like a good distressed hat? Let's see. $30. Raising the price of the hats now. I like this, the white sweatshirt. But again, I can't be trusted with anything white because it'll be dirty immediately, especially while you're in a theme park. But I do appreciate the down the sleeve stuff. I'm a sucker when there's a pattern on a sleeve. That is $60. Is this the 15 year anniversary? Oh, so this is from last year. I don't think I realized this was celebrating 15 years last year. It says Expedition Everest. Expedition Everest, Legend of the Forbidden Mountain, Disney's Animal King. Oh, I am an idiot. It says 15 years of Roman with snowmen. And of course they have the, the Bigfoot plush here. It looks so derpy. <laughs> it looks like a, like a Muppet character or something. But also this could probably be the Yeti from Disneyland as well, maybe. I know it's not, but we can dream. We can dream. What do they have here? Adventure pack. Look at that. Arming kids inside of this park. For only $15, your kid can run into me full force with one of these open. Another item I'd get filthy absolutely immediately the second you set it down on any theme park attraction that you go on. <laughs> I like the colors though, it's cute. Yeti for anything. I can see what you did there. $36.99. He has that sweatshirt again. Oh, nope. This is a cutoff version of it. This one is $50. Oh, and there's a t-shirt version of the, of the Roman with the snowman. Actually, this is really nice t-shirt material. Oh, and he's on the back. Look at that. Look at that. $36.99. Look at this guy. Oh, I can't get this up. Summit team. Taking new adventures to new heights. Oh, oof, this is a rough material. I like the gear on the back, though. And the Anandapur. I can't say it. Anandapur. Anandapur. I do like that they have the stuff down the sleeve again. I feel like it adds value. $39.99. $39.99. Good God in heaven, I can't get this hat off. I don't know. This is kind of funny. But this is like... I don't think this is a Disney product. Yeah, it's a lope. Yeah. Cheap. 30. I do like this this sweatshirt because it's like that classic crew neck sweatshirt. And it's like the upraised leather. That's $45. I said leather and I meant leather. A cantina mug. Summit gear. I do like this like graphic of the Yeti. 
it's doing something for me. $22.99. Can also get one of these art prints. Larry Dotson. Larry Dotson. Do you know who that is? We got Dotson here. $35. Craig affectionately called these the buff boy shirts. I was going to say, the adult one doesn't bother me so much. It's the kind of weird, creepy six-pack on the child one that is a little weird to me. But the kids one is 20 and then the adult one is 25 It's like kind of cheap material shirt, but... Cheap. Cheap, cheap. Uh, and then there's this, like... Is that a towel hoodie blanket? Just a blanket. Oh, just a blanket. With a hood. It's no? Portable. Yeah, it's got a little hood. Like a little... You can wrap yourself up and watch your television programs. How much is that? That one is a bundle. We don't know. My guess is $50. No, no tags, no tags, no tags, no get. No tags, no get. That's the rule. Nobody's getting it now. Nobody's getting it. I don't care. The blanket is 40. Over here we have our uh, $14.99 Yeti clip. I have, there are 15 people in here. I have no idea how it got so incredibly loud so quickly. But the clip, I like this little one where he's like a little popsicle. $30. That's a lot for a little kid's shirt. I like that they're just the idea that you're going to be cold in here. Oh my god, this is the most uncomfortable blanket ever. For $28.16, too. What a weird price. You can get one of these like furry blankets. You fleece throw, but don't 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 it's it, it's a lot. It seems like something you'd find in a house in Maine. But you know what? Good vibes only. Okay, I thought it was it said Llama Queen and I didn't understand, but then Craig said what did you say? Yama Queen? Oh, I was messing around with you. Yeah, but I feel like it It doesn't... Llama Queen doesn't really make... The Adventure Alpaca My Bag. That's funny. I don't get the Llama Queen, though. Llama Queen. Llama Queen. I'm trying to say it fast. Like, it's supposed to mean something. $30 for these bags. Oh, this is a scarf. An infinity scarf. I like how this person on the right is wearing it. Mando. Mando. It's a very... Why don't they sell these in Galaxy's Edge, but with, like, a plain print? That's leopard. That's leopard. Are you sure it's leopard and not cheetah? Yeah, it's leopard. Is it reticulated giraffe? Look at this fancy rain jacket. This is, like, heavy duty. Uh, is that is that somebody? Helly Hansen? Helly Hansen. The guy from Deadliest Catch. From Deadliest Catch. Oh, my. 175 The deadliest price tag. They have uh, red panda plushes that I'm sure these will be pretty popular with the uh, the kids and adults. Twenty four ninety nine. Classy little earrings here. I almost wore a shirt with this print. Not as glittery. The panda's so hot right now. Thirty four ninety nine. Random towel, and of course the classic safari Mickey hat as well here. That I think the wild about adventure. It seems like that should be on the. It's on the wrong side here. Maybe it just swings back around. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know fashion. $25. Then there's this other class here. This is a UV uh, 50 UPF. UPF? That sounds made up. I thought it was SPF. Anyway, $65. A couple more Yeti shirts. I do like this one. Summit gear. This is the same one that I think was on the mug before. It was. It's got that buff boy. Yeah, they made, they have, these are precariously placed uh, pieces of his hat. Twenty four ninety nine, and it's not, it's really actually not that bad of a quality. Y'all Yeti for this, I want to burn this building down. Twenty, oh, it's not a Disney product, Twenty nine ninety nine. That is from Par- Parodies Company. Yeti or not, here I come. We already saw this one. I can't handle it anymore. Hold on. I conquered Expedition Everest. And then... Did we see this one, maybe? I don't now I'm circling around. Abominables Everest Summit Tours. Also, it's the same guy. And, like, why? This design's fun, though. I like this one because it's like the split track. Oh, the quality is horrible, and it's $36.99. So there you have it. That is the Everest gift shop. Uh, there's, you know, not a ton of stuff in there, but it was a little bit easier to navigate. I mean, there were still a bunch of people in there. Um, but, yeah, um, I don't know. 
people people requested this one, so this this is what what I do. I, I go to places that are requested of me. So, um, yeah, I, I don't know. I, has anybody ever gotten anything fun here? There's a couple of snacks. There's pins and stuff like that in there, too, that I didn't show because I just like to show the fun stuff, really. Stuff I like. But even in this version, I had to kind of show you everything because I don't... I was like, it's not my type of merchandise always. That is it. That is going to do it for this uh, shopping video. Thank you, everybody, for joining me here. If you like the video, thumbs, thumbs up and subscribe to the channel, of course. And please feel free to leave me any comments. Tell me where to go next, uh, what you want to see more of, and I will do my best to accommodate you. So I hope everyone's doing well. I'll see you later. Bye!